It's carrying around a burden of, of, of uh, anger and, and hatred. That's gone. I mean, what I see now is just absolutely incredible. That is Dr. William Lynn Weaver, who in 1964 became one of 14 African-American students who integrated the all-white West High School. The speech was given at West High School in March of last year when he returned for the first time in five decades. Dr. Weaver died last Saturday at the age of 69. In March of 2018, Dr. Weaver received a warm welcome back to West High School, a far cry from what he says was the reality back in 1964. He shared with them the unpleasant experiences he faced as the first African-American student at the school, telling us he faced unsupportive teachers who failed him in many subjects. A middle school teacher took the time to tutor him and even helped him apply for scholarships. He talked with us last year about returning to the school to talk to those students about doing what is right in the face of what is wrong. Weaver would go on to become a surgeon, a chief of surgery at Morehouse School of Medicine in Atlanta. He would also share a story of life with NPR in 2017. And the ignorance of youth and wisdom of age is when you look back on it, you say, how did I get there? How did I make it? One of the things he said to NPR in that story. We also